Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to design a real estate banner in Photoshop. First, I will create a domain 2000 by 2000. I will keep this measurement in pixels. I will keep resolution 300 and background content so I Now I will create a rectangle. I select this one by pressing Ctrl key. I am going to change the rectangle color to white. I am going to unlock this background and I will select both and then I will create a group by using Ctrl G. I am going to rename this in background. Now I will lock this one. Now I will use pen tool for designing. First, we will create a design. First, here I will use roller. I will keep it in the center. Now I will select this one for this I am going to, I'm going to hit the option then create transform plan. Now I can resize this one. Now I am going to copy this one by pressing Ctrl G. I will keep this one under this first one. Now I will Select the under shape by pressing Ctrl G. I moving it down. Now I will change this color. I keep this color light blue. This color code is 52B 5BD. I will give this PSD file in the description box, then you can download it from here. Now I will create a circle. Now here I will use it. I will keep this image. I hope the all I am going to select this one by pressing Ctrl G. I am going to create this clicking mask. That's why I click on the layer, right click on the layer, and then click clicking mask. Now I'll create rounded rectangle that's why I keep this 40 pixel 40 pixel I will change this color to white I will copy this one by pressing Ctrl J and then I will select this one by pressing Ctrl T now I am going to resize this one now I will change the color of I will change fill color. I am going to align this to the right. Clicking control and then. Now I am going to create round the rectangle first. I will keep this 20 pixels. Now 
I think this color, I believe, white color here. Now I'm going to copy this one again. That is in Ctrl. I'm going to select it by pressing Ctrl T. Now I will resize this one. Now I'll change this fill color to this blue. I'm going to align this to by pressing Ctrl T. I'm going to align this. Now I will select this one. Now I am going to copy this one by pressing Alt Shift. Now select this all shape. By pressing shift key. Now I will copy the shape again by pressing Ctrl J. I will keep this a little bit above. Now I will change this bit color. I will keep this ellipse behind the first ellipse. Now I will use this in shape. I'll select this image. I'm going to increase the size of it. I will. I'm going to create on. I'm going to click on the right click and then create click image. Right. Again, I'm going to resize this image. Then I'm going to Take with the same size, then put it in the right place. Now I'm going to I will select this out by pressing shift key. I'm going to group this. I will name this one design. Now I will lock this here. I will type here. Here I will use the version font. I, I will keep this font size 100 pt on these points. Then I will keep even this color. I will decrease the font size. I'll keep this one in the center. I'm going to copy this one that is not shift. Now I will bring in this. Now 
I will decrease this font size. I'll select go. I'm going to align. Now I will draw a round effect. And I'm going to copy this. I am going to select this uh, microphone chip key and I'm going to copy this. I will rename this text. That's it for today's tutorial. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.